Well, hello everybody, and welcome back to my playthrough of Final Fantasy, the Pixel Remastered version, and I've decided what exactly I'm going to do. And it doesn't look like it's on the map, but... I think what I ultimately decided to do was... I'm not going to go to Mount... Luke right away. I think what I want to do is try to do the trial of ordeals first. But here's the part. I gotta find it on the map first. And hopefully I can. That's right, run away, Sahagin Chief. <sighs> so basically, I want to try and level level up and promote my classes before I tackle Mount Galoo. And from my past experience in the ice. In the ice cave from from my red mate challenge, I'm going to want those levels before I tackle the ice cave. So I'm kind of going out of sequence, but I would have had to do those two dungeons eventually. Well, the ice cave I would have had to do eventually. If I were going to challenge myself and not pro promote classes, that would have been. Well, Castle of Ordeals would have been skippable. I'll risk the paralysis. And I got paralyzed. Now when I bought those fence downs, I was actually considering doing ice cake first, but... Alright, let's see. Alright, this should be where I need to go. Now normally... Uh. Alright, I... Kind of overshot it here. But normally what you were intended to do was, once you get the airship, you could do the, the trial of ordeals, but... Alright, and with that, Rubicante's leveled up, and Barisha's leveled up. Yeah, that's where I'm supposed to go, but now that I got the canoe, I can actually... And before I finish that end, two new enemies, the worm. Just getting canoe just allows me a shortcut. Alright, so hmm, I don't Oh, I can actually change weapons in this version, so that would have been that's a good thing to know. Hmm. 
Okay, there we go. Okay, not as so as close to looking up, but I was gonna say normally you were supposed to, that area in the top left corner. What what you're intended to do is get the get the airship land there and make your way all the way around to where I'm about to go. But the canoe acts as a shortcut. All right, so before I go in. All right, so yeah, cancel deals is actually the Citadel Trials. Hey, yeah. Ah, oh, thank you. I just hope I remember how how this works. Yeah, there's only one way to go, and that's on the throne. All right, and yeah. In remakes and remasters, like this one, well, in the past these were pillars, but thanks to time and technology, you can now see their teleporter their teleporters. All right, try to remember which one I'm supposed to go in. I think it's this one. It was not. But yeah, I can run into enemies here. Right, let's go to the bottom one then. And a new enemy, Medusa. I believe she can turn us to stone as well. I mean, it is Medusa. But that er there that goes. Hmm. I think it's this one. I hope I got it right. Looks like I did. And a new enemy! Dragon Zombie! Yeah, they're also weak to light and fire, so... I think because there's just the one, I can deal with it. Yes, not. So that stun was temporary. There we go. And with that, Kangnaza leveled up. Got some HP gains, that's good. But also strength gain. Alright, so I think it's... The far corner. I was wrong. Forgive me, it's been a long time. I think it's been a year since. And another new enemy, the Horned Devil. And one will just try to flee. Oh, they can cast fire spells. Okay. I think I think I meant to I meant to meet them at Mount Galug. There we go. Alright, Scarmillion is close to leveling up. And with that one, Scarmillion leveled up. Not much in terms of HP. Alright, so... And we've got another new enemy, Rakshasa. I try and remember if there was anything special about them. Oh, they can put you to sleep. And slow you down, so they got magic. 
Oh, they can heal themselves too! Yeah, my melee fighters aren't going to be doing much. Hmm. Based on this, I better go with Hilara. Yeah, that slow spell's really done a number. But luckily, slowing people down does not affect magic. Alright, so got our first treasure here, a potion. Oh, they also got dark, so I better deal with these guys as soon as possible. Hmm. That didn't do much. So maybe I should go Blizzara instead. Oh great. One was going to constantly be healed every turn. There we go. Alright, things are back to normal. I'm trying to remember which teleporters going to do which, but... I just can't remember which one. I think it's... Alright, there's a new enemy here. Minotaur Zombies. Hmm, let's see. And let's go Diara and Fira. Since they're undead, Diara will be effective, and so will Fire. And there we go. I better heal Skarmelion up. I hope this is the right teleporter. It was not. I... I need... I should have gone back and... Let that... Oh! Ah, oh, darn it. I still have Barbarisha set to Diara and Medusas aren't undead. That's what happens if you rush in too quickly into your... Well, that's what happens if you lock in a strategy from a previous battle. Alright, should be... Oh good, got a preemptive strike, so... Yeah, just being able to focus on one should do it. I think it's this one. And it was! I shouldn't... <clears throat> I should have known that. Alright, now we're on to the proper spot. And let's speed things up a bit. Yeah, gotta watch out for that gaze. It will turn you to stone. And with that, Ruicante and Barbaricia both gain levels. Though not much in terms of stat gains. And, well, got an enemy we're gonna have to fight here. 
Nightmares. I try to remember what Snort does, but uh, I think it flicks a status. I just don't remember which one. And down they they go, and Kanazo leveled up. Got some much needed HP and a bit of agility. Yeah, let me let me do some proper healing. There we go. Let's get this treasure chest. Ah, oh, healing staff. That's actually pretty useful. Yeah, it casts a low level heal spell once used. I mean, not much in terms of attack, but you're not using it to attack. And a new enemy, Mind Flares. I think these were the enemies I'm dreading. Well, I was dreading. So, I'm gonna try Fandaga them. Oh. That Mind Blast is paralysis, but I think what I was hearing I do remember if these are the ones that did the instant death attack. They were. And with that, Skarmillion gained a level. Ooh, and I get three Phoenix Downs. That is going to help me. Yeah. It was the Mind Flares I was worried about. Alright, got a Ruby Armlet. I think I'll pass that down to... to Kanaza. An Ice Brand and some Steel Gloves. Alright, I can give the Ice Brand to... to Rubicante. It feels weird saying... giving an Ice Weapon to a Fire Elemental. What? What else could I do? There we go. Alright, so I... Actually, there was something I... Wait, it was configuration, it was... I'm just checking for classic. Oh yeah, this is much better to ch I should have done this in the first episode, but I didn't. And some monsters. The clay golems. I try to remember days. Alright, let's see. Hmm, based on HP. I might want to go Proterra here. And... Yeah, I'm going to go Furaga. Oh, they can cast Haste! Yeah, I might as well speed things up. Oh yeah, they would have high magic resist. Alright, that takes care of the clay golems. And in here, we got gauntlets. Alright, they cast Vandara when used, so... I think I should keep... Not equip these. Even though they got a defense of six. Well, they had the same stats as the Mithril Gloves. So yeah, I'm not going to bother equipping those. I, I will use them as an item if I need to. Alright, so... Yeah, in here we get... A rat, a rat's tail. 
There's our proof of courage. And yeah, before we can leave, gotta deal with this guy. A pair of dragon zombies. Alright, so it's Diara and I want Firaga. And down they go. Alright. At least with the gauntlets I can save spell charges. But that should be everything in the Citadel Trials, so... I'm gonna check for time and... Well, I got plenty. Yeah, I might as well see if I can show what what item usage can do. It can actually make these seed battles at least that much easier. And of course that healing staff is going to come in handy. And I get a potion. Yeah, pretty much as long as I'm at still have to go out to sea. This is the way I can I can really make things that much quicker. Ah, that feels so good. Finally having items I can use in battle is going to make things much easier. I should... Alright, that big eyes ran away. Alright, hopefully I can get Barbarisha to get some healing in. Alright, and I got a potion for that. So now it feels like every every party member has gone on their oh well, their own different experience path. Thank you. Thanks, Mind Flayer. All right. So I pretty much know where I want to go next. All right, and with that, Barish is leveled up. Got some agility and luck. Alright, so, hmm. hmm. Based on this, I should actually go up and come up with a new enemy, the White Croc. I try to make weak to Blizzard or, or Lightning, but yeah, they hit hard. Right, it's this way. 
And another new enemy, Diochu. Yeah, there are a few enemies that are exclusive to the... Well, to the rivers that we canoe on. Alright, there's our ice cave. And another new enemy, the red piranha. I believe they are weak to lightning. Alright, thank you. Thanks for getting that second healing, Barbaricia. Alright, and with that, Tanazo and Rubicante both level up. Hmm. Alright, got some HP and some strength. And Kanazo got me some luck, but stat wise, those weren't good level ups. I believe there is a couple of enemies left. But I got hope to find them on my way back. All right, and with that, Scarmillion gained a level and got so much needed HP, a point in intellect. But other than that, I kind of wish it got some more in stats. All right, so yeah, now I really need to check for time and. Yeah, I won't have enough time to explore the explore the ice cave, so Yeah, I definitely need to use a cottage before I do so, so I'll do that in between episodes. There are a couple enemies on in the river in the rivers that I need to Need to find out. I think I'll try and look for him on my way back to the ship once I'm done with the ice cave. So, until the next episode, I want to thank you for watching and I hope you have a good day. So, until then, stay safe, be kind to each other, and treat others with love and respect. Ooh, thanks, everyone. <laughs>